Hi guys, so today I'm going to film another plan with me for, um, Blog Ember, and this is Blog Ember day number eight, so we got through the first week. Sorry about my nails, I still haven't done them, it was a really busy week this week, you guys. But next video, the next plan with me, I pinky promise that they are going to be painted, and everything's going to be awesome. So, for last week, you guys saw in my last plan with me, which I'll link um, down below, and in this video, I did the first plan with me for the week of November, and I did a little something different where I put a checklist on every single day, and I put full boxes, but I did them sporadically and randomly, and I really loved how this week turned out. You can see I was using my planner a lot more. I randomly started decorating this week with little sock monkeys <laughs> that I got for 97 cents at Walmart, but they were just cute and they were in my sticker stash. So, it's Saturday, so I'm not completely finished with this week, but I actually used my planner this week all week, so I was very... <coughs> Excuse me. I was very happy with this week, so I'm going to do the same exact thing for next week, except for my sidebar. My sidebar I'm going to change up a little bit, but for the most part, I'm going to do the same exact thing for this week. I'm using another Oh Hello, not Oh Hello, another Hello, ooh, whoa. Sorry, I moved the tripod a little bit, because <laughs> the tripod's right in front of me, so I hit it a little. But I'm using another Hello Emma kit. This is her vintage floral kit. Once again, this is the old formatting of her um, weekly kit, so it looks a little differently on her website. But if I can find the weekly kit in the new formatting, I will link it down below. So I got the functional sheet, which comes with six headers that say to clean, to do, to go, little things today, and to buy three hydrate stickers, three full box checklists, three full boxes, three full, three flags, a lot of icon stickers, a weekend banner, a plan, a workout, a to watch, to clean, to do, and to go, and then three blank headers on the functional sheet. Once again, this is old formatting, so you get a little bit of a different sticker variety in the new ones. I got the add-on to get all the half boxes in the add-ons for the full boxes and these fit the happy planner perfectly and she has she has some size for the Erin Condren, the Erin Condren vertical and the happy planner. So that's the theme for this week. I also went through my um sticker stash and found these pop up three D stickers that I thought matched this kit pretty well. Um, it has that vintage floral look, and it has a little bit of wood, which I'm planning on using these wood washies for this week. These came in a, um, duo set from Michaels from the Recollections brand, um, so I decided to use those because I thought they were the washi that matched the most, and, you know, wood and floral, I just thought it would be really pretty together. And then I found this sheet in my sticker stash. I don't know where I got this from because I got it as a birthday gift. So most likely it came from Hobby Lobby or Michaels. My bet is Hobby Lobby because it's not a brand that I recognize. So, but they're really pretty and I just thought I could use some of them to decorate this week. Not all of them match the colors perfectly, but some of them do. So I thought I could just use a couple of them because last week I noticed that some of the full blank spots I wanted to decorate and that's when I started pulling out these random sock monkeys and hearts and started decorating them because they matched the color scheme pretty well so I decided I would already have a weekly sheet set out for decoration. They are 3D but I actually don't mind this time around since I am only using this planner up to December. I took January to December of next year out. So I only have from July this year when I started using this planner to December of this year since I'm going to get a new planner for 2017, 16, 2016. Wow, I want it to be a whole year ahead. <laughs> since I'm getting a new planner for 2016, I just took out the inserts for the other weeks so that it wouldn't be so bulky because I know I'm going to be. So now I can go a little sticker ham on it. I still have my little note to self that's washied in with all the things going on this week and it's a pretty busy 
week, especially on Tuesday. Apparently, my teachers just all came together and said, we're all going to throw all this work on them on Tuesday. <laughs> but, so that's this week. Um, last week, I started off with headers first, like the little, the washi strips to cover up the headers. And I kind of wish I had done full boxes first because sometimes the full boxes would overlap the washi and it kind of bugged me. So I'm going to do full boxes first and put down my weekend banner. And then something else I'm doing a little different this week is I'm actually going to use these three full box checklists um, in the actual week. Last time I only used one and I used it on the sidebar and I don't like the way that that looks. <laughs> I'm going to keep an open sidebar like I had been doing before like here. My Halloween week I had an open sidebar and on my fall floral week I had an open sidebar and I kind of want to keep that. I think it looks a little bit cleaner and better. So I'm going to use these three full box checklists um, sporadically in the days and I'm going to put down my full boxes as well so that way the full box stickers don't overlap the washi. Start with my weekend. I think I might use some darker colors on the weekend. So let's go with this one right here on Saturday. Like I said last week, Hello Emma Co stickers are nowhere near repositionable. So I try to get them down right the first time. <laughs> And I'm going to go with this green one right here. So that way it's not like two very, very dark colors next to each other. But it's still dark enough that the weekend banner will pop. Okay. And then I'll take the weekend banner from this sheet. Try to line it up straight because the last time it was nowhere near straight. And K the middle. That looks straight. Yeah, that's pretty straight. Yay. And now I'm just going to put the rest of the full boxes down. Let me figure out which one I want. I really want this one in the top corner. Covering up this little calendar. Which, can you guys even see that? No, you cannot. <laughs> About the calendar and the notes. Oh, oh gosh. <laughs> So that's how the full box has turned out. And now I'm going to put the full box checklist on, I think, every other day. 
And one on Saturday at the top. Let's do them at the top. Actually, I want this one at the bottom. <laughs> Someone decides it. <laughs> all the full box checklists and now I'm going to put the washi over the headers because the flags kind of overlap if you can see this my washi sticking to everything the flags the checklist flags kind of overlap on the washi so I don't want the washi to cover that up so oh I'm going to put the washi down now, and I just pre-cut these, um, the darker wood washi into little strips to cover up the headers, and I used my Westcott paper trimmer from Walmart that I got for like $10, which is an amazing deal, because other ones are like kind of on the expensive side, so I was really happy when I found that one for a pretty nice inexpensive cost. <laughs> I'm still not going to cut through, so I'm going <laughs> to use my exacto knife to get it. And I just try to cut it pretty lightly so it doesn't cut through the paper. There we go. Make sure you put the cover back on it so you don't stab yourself <laughs> or anyone else. <laughs> Sorry, the struggle. Is this going to be long enough to put right here? Yes, perfect. Oh, 
Alright. And then for last week, I didn't put any washi at the bottom. So I kind of wish I did. So I'm going to take the lighter green wood washi and put that at the bottom. Of yeah, the week. That's pretty straight. Alright. Washing is down. And now I'm just going to put on the rest of these flat checklists. And I just need one more for Sunday, so I'm going to pull from my sheets, well, this is one sheet that I cut down, a full box checklist that are also from Hello Emma Co. and try to find a cover that matches okay <laughs> the rest of this kit. Oops. Maybe, maybe this one. Yeah, I'll just go with this one. And put this at the top of Sunday. Oh, and it kind of covers up my weekend a little bit, so let me pull that up. Just tuck it under. Okay. So there we go the bones of the week laid out and I think before I go for doing day to day I'm going to do my sidebar first so I'm going to take this to D sticker from the kit and just put that there and then I think that's really all that, that I have. <laughs> I'm not going to put down a social media sidebar sticker this week just because the ones that I have left don't match with this spread at all. So I'm not going to do I'm not going to do that. So, let me put a sticker sticker over here. I think I'm going to take this life is better with friends little pop-up sticker and put that over top of here. Yeah, I think that's adorable. And yeah, it's used this for a really long <laughs> weekly to-do list. So there's that. And as most of you know, it is Blog Ember. So I'm going to put in all of my um, blog post and videos that are going up this week, and I'm going to do it the same way I did it last week using these um, icon stickers for the Oh Hello Stationery blogger and YouTuber set. The play buttons are for videos, and the cameras are going to be for blog post. Let me see my little 
told you this, I'm just dropping things left and right. <laughs> See my little list. So Monday, our fall nail polishes is going up. Tuesday, it's a video of what's in my purse. Wednesday, it's a Happy Veterans Day post. I'm trying to get colors that kind of match this spread's color theme. Thursday is a video on my planner storage. Huh. Friday is a fashion blog post. Saturday is an empties video. My play button looks a little backwards. So <laughs> and Sunday is a plan with me. And now I'm going to put in my TV shows, <laughs> TV is my wife. <laughs> Tuesday is the Mindy Project. And Thursday is Bones. And I have a boatload of shows on Sunday, so I'm going to take this to watch checklist and I'm actually going to move the play button. Let me put that down. And resituate my play button. Okay. Okay, so that's all of that. Now we can go day by day. So Monday I have a paper due, so I'm going to take wherever my little half boxes went, because this always happens during plan with me, my desk has become a complete mess. Okay, my charm, my little half boxes. I'm going to take this cute lighter print one. And I have a little paper due. Which is not a little paper, it's pretty big paper. <laughs> but it's, it's due on that day. And I'm going to take a little green document sticker. Put that there. Okay, that's all I have for Monday. Tuesday, I have a club meeting. So I'm going to put that. Another little half box. Actually, a lot of things are going on on Tuesday. <laughs> um, I also have a project and a paper due that day. But they're all pretty minor things. So. I'm actually going to take these headers to write those down instead of using up all of my full boxes. I'm going to take these blank headers to write down that I have a paper and a presentation and a project. So I'm going to use up all of these blank headers for Tuesday.
I saw Boulder Bond do this in one of her plan with me. And I just thought it was genius because that way they're still notifying them, but they're kind of it's a little crooked. It's kind of in a subtler way and you can fit a lot more in your day. So I have a presentation. I'll take a sticker for that. <laughs> And I have a project, which I'll just take another little sticker for, another little graph sticker. There's all the things happening on Tuesday. Pretty busy. <laughs> Wednesday I actually have the day off, which is awesome. So I'm gonna take a little hash box to know that I have the day off. Cause it's Veterans Day. And then I'm also going to go see a movie with my friends. I'm going to take, if I can <laughs> find them on my jumbled desk, here is my Hello Emiko movie stickers. I'm just going to put down this pink one. And we're going to go see the movie Goosebumps together. And then Thursday, I have a quiz and my report cards come out for the week, I mean for the semester. <laughs> Those are two very important things. Put a half box for your report card. Actually, I'm going to put this half box down at the bottom because I don't like it when two half boxes are in the same box. If that makes any sense. <laughs> I don't know, it looks overcrowded to me. And I don't want to cover up that pretty pattern too much. So I have a box right here for my report cards. And I guess I'll just take another little um, Maybe a graph sticker? I guess a graph sticker makes sense because they report cards. <laughs> and now I'm going to take a different half box sticker for my quiz. Okay. And then Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I have nothing really planned yet, so this is kind of the extent of my week for right now, and I'm going to fill it in with... <clears throat> okay, so I'm back, and I just added a couple of things. I made my weekly to-do list for right now. Um, and I put a little something down here in the corner, this little butterfly pop-up sticker from the same sheet that this Life is Better with Friends sticker came from. And I filled in everything. And then I added this little rose on wood sticker from the same sticker sheet. And I added this to clean sticker on Saturday. But that is next week, so I'm going to pick you up and show you an overview of the entire week, and then we'll be done. Okay, so that's, um the plan with me for November 9th to November 15th. I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you for the next one. Bye!